Jay, we ain't turn this freak ass music off and let's get serious. What the hell is wrong with you? Right there. The low you get the freak you get her. <laughs> uh uh uh. <laughs> Y and Luch. That was about Y M F and Luch. I think that song came out the year I moved to Atlanta. Whoa, whoa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the remix was hard too. Who was on the Damn. remix? Everybody. Rest in peace, Scoob and Takeoff. They were both on. Oh yeah. And they went they were back and forth, like and I wanted them to do a whole album like that because yeah. they were so cold to me. Damn. <laughs> Hits, hits that stick like grits. Come on, man. Y'all ready? All right, look. The black market is here, man. Yeah. The black market is here. The blackness of markets. There it is. It's open. When I ring the bell, they know it's black money in the building. Period. I like your little bell. That's nice. Yeah. Yeah, we ain't asking for shit, though. We just <laughs> alerting people. <laughs> we alerting people, letting them know that there's money in the building, there's money on the flow. Period, and it is. And it's the black market once again, where oh, yeah. we highlight and we showcase uh, black and minority-owned independent businesses mm -hmm. all around the world. And today, we have none other than... What? Dre Nicole is in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cause you know she about her business, business woman. And that's the fact. Business woman, and she got a new one that she about to put us up on. I Welcome do. to the black market. You been to the trap? Thank you. Ain't you. Been to the black I haven't. This is my first time. It's more elegant in the daytime. Mm -hmm. Yeah, at night it's a trap. Feel, I feel you. I can see that. Business. This this does seem a little bit more professional. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's how we get down. What mm -hmm. you got for us today? Um, so I have my new lip gloss line. It's called Muse Beauty. Okay. Okay. I've been having it running for about four months now. The website. You just now getting here? Yeah. You supposed to launch this on the black market. I know. I launched it on Breakfast Club. Okay. That is not the black market, but okay. I mean, you know, I, I launched it on a big day. Well, how's it been? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to say the black market. No, that's not what I'm saying. Nah. <laughs> Honestly, when I launched it, y'all wasn't recording this season of Black Market. You're right. You absolutely. So you gotta give me a little, a little credit. She was waiting till the season sparked up. She couldn't wait to, to but the people needed I to know. The people needed the product. People need lip gloss. Yeah. Immediately. Immediately. So what inspired you? Serious this? business. Um, so I just always have really been into makeup and cosmetics, and I always wanted to have my own cosmetics line. And I feel like I procrastinated a while on doing it, and then I finally was just like, fuck it, I'm gonna go ahead and launch it. And yeah, I wanted to name it. I feel like I told you on one of the 85 episodes why I named it what I named it. What? You want to inspire people. Or maybe it was an app. It might have been. Because, you know, you get to say in a lot of wild shit when you want to inspire stuff. So I wanted, to name my, I wanted to name my business something after my dad, because my dad passed away in uh, 2020. So when I was, thank you. So when I was coming up with the name, I wanted to name it something that had, like, the letters from his name in it. And so that's how I came up with Muse. They got what? And then I also like the meaning behind the word muse right. as well. So you got some shades over here. What you would got? you like to see the shades? I, would like I, to have, see the I have a plethora of I would shades. I love to see the shades. You know, for yeah. different skin tones. So this is like a peachy nude. This is actually what I have on right now. Peachy nude. Mm hmm Okay, yeah. I see where this is yeah. going. In the color. Sound like a picture you get. 
That's a peachy nude. Yeah, that's, that's a peachy nude right there. That is a peachy nude. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you need some artwork. Hey, man. We keeping it on brand. Yeah. So, yes, yeah, so this is actually what I have on right now. It's called peachy, and it's like a really beautiful color for, like, darker skin tones. I also wanted to make that a, a theme of my brand, too. Like, I wanted to come out with different colors for different skin tones. Because I think a lot of the time, black women kind of shy away from, from color. Like, we like to stay real neutral. Yeah. And so right now, I do have, like, a lot of nudes, but I actually have some new products coming out in a few weeks. And I'm going to, you know, come out with a lot of different colors. That's dope. Because I want women to not be afraid to try different colors right. on their skin tone. Because I think chestnut, mm -hmm. cold So these are lip liners. It's given. Yes. That's like a shimmery, clear gloss. Let me just take everything glaze. out the package. And glaze is clear, because you can't never go wrong with a clear gloss and a brown lip liner. And I actually have on a cold brew lip liner right now, too. I'm looking like this so shit like I So tell them how to put it, just tell the ladies out there if they want the drill. Lip gloss lips. Okay, so like I said, I have on Peachy right now with the cold brew liner. Hold on. Do you have any tips that you can give these ladies on how to apply this? Or yeah, of course. Make it last So I like to overline or get my... the best out of the product. Yeah, so luckily my product is already really long lasting, so it lasts for a long time. You don't have to keep reapplying it. And I know that's what all the girls love, because when you out and you having a good time, you're not trying to have to keep going to the restroom putting on more lip gloss. So it's a long lasting product. But when I put it on, a good tip that I have is I like to overline my lips a little bit, even though they already really full. Um, so if you have even smaller lips than me, it's good to overline your lips when you're putting on your lip liner. And then I just like to put the gloss on, but I love to add the glazed gloss on top because I really like for my lips to be real glossy. And so I feel like you gotta always add that clear gloss on top. You cannot hit the blunt. That's what I was just about to ask. I saw and from it. the dude aspect. I feel like I be making the blunt with. So I don't With the gloss. Yeah. Yeah. I mean so. until I mean that's not <laughs> Okay. That's what that's that's gonna be the collab. Right. 85 Muse collab is the gloss that don't get on the blunt, but it still look wet. That's a good I idea. I want to walk off, bro. That's about the third genius shit you just said in a sitting. Come on, man. I'm, I'm sick of it. <laughs> That's a good idea, actually. And for the girls who don't like for they, they gloss or they lip, you know, lipstick, whatever, to get on the blunt, I have some matte liquid lipstick that's coming out soon that's non-transferable. Mm. Do you have anything for the white people with thin lips? Yes, absolutely. Like I said, I feel like, you know, you can use my liners and you can overline your lips. It will give you the full lip effect right. without, you know, having to go get the fillers and, you know, all the stuff that the girls are doing, me included. So now right. that you got your own lip gloss line, you're probably saving a ton of money just by... By using my own shit, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. What did you used to use? Uh, I used to use Buxom a lot, because I love lip plumping glosses, and so that's actually something that I'm looking into right now. I'm trying to formulate my own lip, plump, lip formulate, plumping gloss. Formulate? Do your shit? Yeah. Do your shit? You really yeah. being a... You got lab coat with the... I don't, but that's but something I'm trying to get into just, right you just, now. You just kind of tell them what you want, yes. and they in the lab, and then they send you the shit, and you tell them it's wrong or right. Right. That's dope. Yeah. And so, I mean, it's definitely been trial and error. Like, I had to try a, different, a few different formulas before I found the one that I like. I see you brought a few photographs. Who are some of your models that you've been using over here? You know, it's me and my girl Kiki from Cocktails. Okay. You no, know, I feel like when you start your business, you can never go wrong with having your friends. Be your model. That's your network. Mm hmm. That's your network. Where is this available at? It's online. It's at www.musebeautycollection.com. It's available right now. And I actually am about to do a Christmas sale. Okay. So, yeah. Is that what you announced? <laughs> How much off? How much off? It's going to be 25% off of the whole site from Christmas until New Year's. And yeah, I'm doing yeah. a giveaway right now, too. Word? Yeah. Well, like, what's what's the terms and conditions? Um, for the giveaway, I'm giving away a $250 Visa gift card as long as you make a $50 or more purchase before Christmas. And I'm also giving away to two people the whole collection because, like I said, I'm coming out with some new products, and so it's going to be like a $225 value oh, for the whole collection. So basically, you go spend some money, you might win some. Spend some money, you might get some money. Mm. Gotta spend it to make it. 
Well, we're gonna on. support you. All the ladies I know, I'm gonna make sure that they got some. Or at least go look. Yes, yeah. you need to tell them to go buy that shit. Oh, I'm telling all the ladies that I know, all the ladies, get some Adrea lip gloss. The muse. And, and you got you got you so you just focus on lips now? You go well, you, for I now. want you to get okay. to the whole face. Yes. I want the eyelashes, mm -hmm. the foundation, the little pimple shit to cover up, everything. <laughs> so all for that. now, <laughs> yes, for now, all I have is lip gloss because that was like my main focus. Because honestly, like on Poor Minds and on my Instagram, that's something that people will always ask me about. They'll be like, what kind of lip gloss do you have on? So, so I feel yeah, like that okay. should be the first thing yeah. that I come out with. But like I said, I'm really into makeup in general. So I want to come out with foundations, concealers. I want to come out with high Highlighters, and eventually I want to actually have like a skincare line too. Skin, yeah, now that is Because I think skincare very important. is important. Hell yeah. You can't have good makeup if you don't have good skin. Yeah, because yeah, some people have good makeup, but your face stink. Stink? You got, yeah, because <laughs> you, ain't, you ain't moisturizing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Exfoliating. It'd be a little dry, you It'd know. It'd be a lot dry. It'd be a lot dry, <laughs> a lot especially dry. with this winter weather. Yeah. Oh, that winter, man. Mm -hmm. right. You gotta stay moisturized, yeah. you're gonna be looking chats. So what can they reach out to you? Cause I know some people gonna want to collab and mm -hmm. you know, get some, some um, what's that shit where you get a shit? influencer uh, type shit? You got yes, some influencers? I, I'm actually looking for influencers right, right you now. Some ladies with some big ass lips. Yes. Some big, and find some regular ladies too. Don't keep getting the same ladies. Find some women who gotta go to work. Absolutely. Find yeah. somebody with no lips. No lips. And I'm still looking for, I want some, diversity with my brand. Yeah. So you find that anybody girl that can apply to be an influencer. shit around her lips. Who? That girl who be on Twitter, she be talking about how men supposed to take care of her and shit. You ain't seen it? I'll send it to you. Okay. It's this girl. She be going viral. Yeah, send her to me. I want anybody to be going viral. She be, she be looking crazy, mm -hmm. though. But yes, you could follow he me. He know who I'm talking about. <laughs> he said. Oh, you know who you talking about? Yeah. You know her Instagram? <laughs> her video going crazy. She be like, a man posted about me everything. Basically, and niggas like, what, you? Is she cute? Yes. Oh, oh. I, that's subjective. Okay. I don't call nobody unattractive. Mm -hmm. Because I've seen I think that's really nice what God me. can do. I've he seen lying. what God can no, do. It's this dude, he went viral. I know, Clay. Yeah. <laughs> he don't have no legs, uh -huh. no bottom half, just arms, uh -huh. and like a torso. And he was on the beach playing with his daughter. He had a little two-year-old. Mm -hmm. So that means somebody fucked him recently. What if he had his legs, though, then? He didn't. He was born without none. Oh, he was born without legs. But wow. clearly, you don't need legs to have a dick. You don't need legs to fuck? Yeah, this is... I'm just, I didn't know. Like, if you're going to be born he with not this... He could just lay there. How you going to have this? So it's more like... You would think he don't have this. Hey, man. But hey. he has this. I don't this. think he fucking. I think he getting fucked. It don't matter. He got no, all he on his quitting. hands, like... Like, just... I Swinging in there. What leg? He's on his hands. Nah. What leg? He's on his hands. See, just I don't. Go ahead. Mm -mm, I wouldn't like that. <laughs> I would rather, way, if I was going to, hypothetically. Yeah, hypothetically. If I was going to fuck somebody that didn't have legs. Didn't have legs. I would prefer to be on top because then we could just have a cover. There is no top to be on. Covering. There is no top. The bottom half, and then I would just imagine that. Ain't no bottom half to cover. Them. It's just going to be. That's what I'm saying. There, there is no. He didn't have like the look, you know. No, no not the thigh up. You mean? It was just. That's possible. Clearly. Clearly. That's real. Oh, everybody doing their interpretation yeah, of what they have. If it was me, if it was me, yeah. I'd sit in the chair. You feel me? How you gonna sit? Shit, the same way he been sitting. Everything is sitting when you ain't got legs. Everything is sitting. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker said, everything's sitting when you ain't got legs. <laughs> Except laying down. He Except made a great <laughs> point. <laughs> hey, get up. I said, get up. <laughs> this is it, baby. <laughs> he, I'm already a. This is it. Fucking, I'm just saying, and don't tell me what God can't do. No, I, I feel you. It's somebody yeah. for. Anybody, somebody for everybody, everybody, man. Somebody, not everybody, everybody, but anybody. So, mm -hmm. somebody, everybody ain't gonna get something. Yeah, because some people just not gonna accept what's for them. <laughs> 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 I, don't, I don't like that. Well, 
Hey, baby. <laughs> it don't matter. Somebody do. What else you gonna do? <laughs> I mean, somebody like it. You might not like it, but somebody like it. I'm just saying. People they, think they're gonna they stay fine forever, and that's just not the case for most people. Mm. I don't think nobody stay fine forever, though. Yeah. Aging is inevitable. No, you gonna age, but some motherfuckers, they just don't know they're gonna age themselves out of the game. Mm. The game that they play. Some of them but what if you are already have, not in the game? That's what they don't realize. They just like, oh, I can have anybody I want. And then all these years going to go by and be like, shit, I ain't had nobody I want. Mm -hmm. And you're out of practice. You can have anybody you want. Well, you go game get them. old. Don't well, nobody go that old ass You better shit. go get them to make sure that you can still get them. I feel like if you ain't never really <laughs> had nobody old. you really want, you can't say that. I'm just saying. People be trying to convince they <clears> but... Once you look back at your history, you're gonna be like, "Woo, I can get some of the people <laughs> that want me, that like me a little bit yeah. already first. <laughs> I've dealt with people who have similar <laughs> interests as me. <laughs> people think I'm okay to be around. As you get older, that narrative changes. Yeah. Shit, you be happy Reality with that. Reality set in. Hell yeah. But that music get, see, but that that muse gonna get, get you, you through. Right. It's timeless. Right. Fuck around and put that shit on and people start thinking you got nice lips. And then you won't get the nigga you really want. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's a hell of a promo right there. Mm -hmm. Tell them where to get it one more time. www.musebeautycollection.com. That's M-U-S-E. You can also follow us on Instagram at musebeauty, but that's beauty with two Y's. And then you can also follow me on Instagram at Drea Nicole with three E's. On what? Drea or Nicole? Eat, uh, <laughs> Nicole. <laughs> so it's Nicole with three E's. Yeah, it's Drea, then Nicole, N-I-C-O-L-E-E-E. -E -E. All your E's is three. So it's yeah. Nicole. Well, beauty is two Y's, one E. There we go. Well, one more. There you have it, yeah. folks. Whether you know it or not, the black market is open and it's still open and it's gotta be open and it's never gonna close. And it's 25% off. And it's 25% off. And it's 25% off. And you can win $250. $250 Visa gift card. So you can do whatever you want with that money. That ain't right. got nothing to do with me. As long as you spend your $50 or more. Spend it. You got that shit. Spend that shit. Get some money from your man. Spend a check spend and get it shit. right back. Come on. There you have it, folks. Black market. Trend the code. We out of here.